Okay, Commodore Jeff Zambello here at the Royal uh, Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Satterbrook, New Jersey. There's no duck, so I am out of luck. Steamed dumplings, chow mein fun, shrimp and creole, got brown rice. Actually, this looks good. Raw fish. You know what I'll do? Gave me an idea. Oh, there he is. The king. The king of Mongolian barbecue. Look at that. Look at the vapors. The vapors of life are, are ascending into heaven. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let me, let me see if these people took all my food. Hold on. No, no, there's still food there. Okay, so I get, I get to make it later. Okay, what do we have? Oh, again, lamb breast? They had that last Friday. Uh -huh. What do they do to the codfish? Look. Like a bunch of vultures. They, they took all the codfish. What's going on? Alright. I have a new idea. I'm going to make my own style of paella. I'm going to use my imagination. Uh, Exorcist Bishop Brian. But I'm sure they'll bring out more cod. Uh, I'm gonna get some brown rice, mixed vegetables, and shrimps. Now watch what I'm gonna do. Exorcist Bishop from the Travel Channel hit show Ghost Adventures and Jeff Sambell. I'm gonna lay a bed. And a lot of women that should be laid on the bed too. Ha ha ha, hearty, hearty, har har. I'm gonna lay a bed of this, right? Nice brown rice. And right, then. Oh my god, they. What they got? Oh, the lamb is back. The lamb is back with the uh, onions. Look what they did to the codfish, the bacalao. Oh, they destroyed it. They destroyed the bacalao. Oh my god. Get some of this. Mussels and clams with the juice on top of the brown rice. Look at that, beautiful. Look at this, look at this. Now, the, I use my head, see, because what's gonna happen is all oh, that bouillabaisse seafood broth, the, the, the broth, the fruit de damar, the broth of the sea is gonna go into the brown rice. It's gonna permeate the brown rice. Ah, are you smart? Are you, sh are you a smart cookie, James P. Madonna, or what? You a smart cookie. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Right over, right over the brown rice. Look at that. Get some um, little neck clams. Not little neck, I'm sorry. Um, cherry stones, I'm sorry. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that, Jeff Sambell, the, the broth of the sea. The broth of the sea is definitely for me. All right. A little more, a little more broth of the sea. So, what's gonna happen is the brown rice, the seafood, uh, cold man's paella is gonna absorb all that broth. Look at it. They, they, they grabbed all the codfish. They massacred it. Look at it. Look at it. What do we got here? We got some lamb with onions. You know what I watched on YouTube? The CCTV Chinese Spring Festival Gala. For Spring Festival. Spring Festival the ga Gala. That Gala. I was watching it. Very nice. Spring Festival Gala. Gala from China. Yeah, you watch it? You know China? Yeah. Yeah, Spring you Festival. It, right? Yeah, I watched it. I watched it. It was very nice. Make sure it's this year. Yeah, not, uh, 2019. Yeah. And they had the Kung Fu, the mar uh, they had the girls with the costumes dancing. And then the thing, dancing. Yeah. Oh, and oh. then the major. But they're all very attractive women that are dancing. No ugly women. No ugly women. No, they, all, they they're only all pick. Pretty. They're all pretty. They're all pretty. Like the, the yeah, like. Like the girls in the Kung Fu movie, you know, the, 
The crouching, the crouching tiger. You know what? Michelle Yao, you know Michelle? Michelle Yao, you know? Spring Gala, and then they have... And then they have the... When is the Dragon Boat Festival? Is that uh, in the in fall? September, October? You know Dragon Boat? The Chinese Dragon Boat Festival? It, it's all beautiful boats with lights in the shape of dra in the shape of dragons all right I just grabbed the yellow ball that's up my waitress she's from China um, uh, oh look at that the ice cream the kids didn't mess up the ice cream it's all all neat look at that plus their little chubby hearts look at that look at how are you my friend very good very good All right. Now, see my strategy. My strategy is going to pan out because, first of all, I have to color coordinate my lemons. She didn't. She don't know. She didn't know. Got to make sure they're color coordinated. And uh, I made my own paella. Old man's paella. All right, I'm gonna begin. This is round one. Okay, round two of uh, Royal Abachi <clears throat> Buffet, Route 46 West Saddlebrook, New Jersey. I'm gonna take part in some Mongolian barbecue. But instead of having shrimp, because I really stuffed myself before with seafood, I'm going to have I'm going to have some steak. I better grab it. So you can put in the plate whatever you want. The plate to have the plate bottom here. All right, now. Now, do I have room for mushrooms here? No. So I will put the mushrooms over here. Put them both because I love I love mushrooms because uh, naturally I'm a fun guy. I'm a fun guy. Jeff Sambello. I'm gonna go with the uh, very muy picante hot and spicy beef. Alright. And um because I'm always getting shrimp, but I had a lot of seafood before from the uh, entrees behind me. Maybe, maybe I should take the whole tray of mushrooms. What do you think? I'll take the whole tray. Okay. They're gonna shrink anyway. Okay, baby corn. No, this corn is not from China. I'm not. I, I'm not gonna take any corn. All right. Where are they? Hard boiled eggs or regular eggs? Oh, no, those are the regular eggs. People will be in ecstasy. Oh look, it's getting busy. Holy man, I better get Oh well, wait a minute. I know what I forgot. Got to get cabbage. Um you know what? Come over here. Make fun rice noodles. Look at that. That's all you're getting. Right. No. no, get pile it on there. Pile it on. You gotta eat. Yeah. All right. All right. Here we go. I'll wait until. Um, oh, look at that. The vapors of life. Look at that, beautiful. You know what I better do? Uh, 
All right. I don't want to take I don't want to take up too much space, so I'll be over here. Oh, I just didn't want to take up too much room. Here, this and this. So, that's all me. That's it. That's all me. You understand, Jabroni? Out there in YouTube land, this is it. I, I don't believe in small portions like you see on the, on the Food Network and the uh, Food Channel. Or those those, those namby candy little wimps that eat it. Not you, not you. Those, those men that are namby candy little women, they eat tiny portions, they pay a lot of money. You know, the rich people, they got a big plate and they got like a little blob of food in the middle and they put sauce, make it fancy design. Nah, this is the way to go. Look at that. All right, now I get out of your way. Hold on. Hold on. I like to hit this from the corner. Boy, I get every everything. Look at that, Jeff Zambella. Look at that. Beautiful, the vapors of life. The vapor, everybody's here. The king of Mongolian barbecue's here. Uh, the the one and only official fri Friday girl is here. That comes every Friday. Oh, somebody's gonna be in ecstasy. Oh, they're breaking the yoke. We're not yoking around here, either. Look at that. Oh, they don't. Oh, they don't. Oh, my. Hold on, I forgot to tell them. Oh, my God. You don't want to talk, right? You don't want to talk? Hold on a second. Oh, mine, mine is a uh, um, muy picante with a lot of garlic. Okay. A lot of pepper and a lot of garlic. Thank you. When you get a chance. Oh, wow. Yeah. There you go, muy picante. Ah, beautiful. Look at that. That's in the order, right? Uh, yeah, when you get a chance. So, yeah, you got a lot of. Do the, do the easy people first. Well, actually, the steak. Yeah, the steak. The, try not to. Uh, it's probably done right now, the steak. Otherwise, it'll be well done. Every, everybody is in the mood for eggs. It's a Mongolian omelet. Mine is, of course, on the left. All right, a lot of garlic and uh, hot pepper on mine. There you go, beautiful. That's mine on the left. Actually, the both of them, uh, the vegetables and the beef, and then, and then everyone else is uh, on the right. What a wonderful smell. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Uh, yeah. the ranch of Mongolia. And this 
guy is unbelievable how he how he can cook so many different meals simultaneously. Commodore Jeff Sandello, simultaneously. The average person probably doesn't even know what simultaneous means. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. We got the Mongolian omelet. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. Here comes my dark sesame oil. He puts the dark sesame oil on every week. What happened? He must have he must have vanished into another dimension. What happened? He went to get the sesame oil and he's gone. Unless they ran out of sesame oil. Good thing I told him to take the beef off when he did, otherwise it would have been well done. It's probably well done now, but you, you can't help it. He's got, got all these orders. You know Jeff Sambella? Where did he go? He went to Japan to get the sesame oil? Where oh, there you go. Oh, they ran out. Oh, my God. Everybody's here. Everybody's here. The, the, the one and only, the official uh, Friday girl is here. The Mongolian king. The, 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 the Benny, better than Benny Han of Tokyo. What the heck? Poor guy. Oh my god. Look at this guy. Unbelievable. Alright, hers is done. All right, you could come to mine. Jesus, holy crap, my goodness. Look at this, oh my God. Brand, a brand new can of, of, of dark imported Japanese sesame oil has to be opened. The cherry has to be popped. Look at that. Oh, oh. That always cracks me up when he pulls up, pulls that thing out. You know Jeff Zambello when he pulls that that that, uh, <laughs> that un uncircumcised um, sesame oil can. And there we go. Beautiful. Look at that. The smell is unbelievable. Unbelievable, look at that. Look at that. This guy's the king. He's the king. Alright, there we go. Thank you. There you go. Get a good bird's eye view of it. There's jabronis out there in the internet. They're all jabronis. Alright. I'm gonna have to shut this up because I gotta carry it with two hands. All right, Commodore. I have to do this because people have been wiping out the codfish. It just arrived, so I'm gonna have to grab some because, for the simple reason, it will vanish. So I'm gonna have to get some of this thick, succulent cod to form a sort of surf and turf image. Otherwise, these these jabronis will totally totally wipe out this cod. I'm telling you right now. You sure? Oh, let me get some thick pieces of cod. Bacalao at its best. These people go for it like it was uh, like vultures in in the desert. You know? All right. Let me get out of the way. So vultures, vultures in the desert. What? They go right, they go right for it. All right, there you go. Now I return to the seat. Okay, James P. Madonna here. I just want to give a quick summary of things. They got, they got the crab out and the shrimp with the uh, heads on them and the shell. This was an excellent idea when I put the seafood with the broth on top of this brown rice with shrimp and vegetables. Um, oh, they got some hardcore sushi. I'll, I'll have some of that. 
Um, now, I forgot to mention that this mixture actually had sea scallops. I was very surprised it had sea scallops. Oh, they're still in there. Sea scallops. Got kebabs. Okay. Let me check out the soups. Hey, look at that. Crab soup is back. I'm going to have to get some crab soup. Just, I'll just get a little, little bit of sashimi here. this is yellowtail or if this is the um, the white tuna I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to ask the man yeah. I'm gonna reach everything Yellowtail or white tuna? Just not sure what it is. Up the ass guy. We got the kimchi, the wakame seaweed. You do what I did last time. The wasabi. I don't see any unagi roasted eel. I don't see any, any, any of that. You know what? Yeah. Let me ask you. So, is that, amigo, is, it, is that white tuna or yellow tail? That's uh, tilapia. Oh, oh, tilapia. Oh, oh, you can have raw tilapia? Or is it fresh water? Oh, all right. All right. If I get sick, if I get sick, it's going to be a problem. This tilapia is a freshwater fish. All right. All right. I'm going to put a little sriracha hot sauce in here. by soy sauce. Oh boy. Then I'm gonna mix the wasabi in with the uh, sriracha and soy sauce. It's getting busy. It's getting busy, man. Now I could get some crab soup. Okay, here's the, here's the papaya, fresh pineapple, papaya, grapes, cantaloupe, 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 here's the, uh, oh, what happened, she took the sign down, I would write her up, I know who did that, I would write her up, tre leche, tre leche cake, a Latin specialty, and here, we have another specialty, that I better grab now while I have the chance. It is called flan. Look at that. Suck d delicious flan has made its return. I know you can't, it is ridiculous to combine flan with sashimi, but if I don't grab it now, it will be all gone. The flan will be gone. Commodore Jeff Zambello. The flan will be
gone. The flan will be gone. I wonder what kind of cookie that is. Kiwi fruit over there. Look at this. The flan will be gone if I don't grab it. That's for damn sure. So what I'm gonna do is, what I'm gonna do is, hey, what's going, what's going on? People are forgetting all about old James Prima Don over here. Where are they supposed to get rid of this? What the hell's going on here? You know what I better do? Let me, let me get another plate because I don't want any crazy flavor uh, combinations taking place between flan and sashimi. Flan shimi. That would not be a good idea. So I will transfer. I will do it carefully without getting soy sauce on the flan. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Is there going to be an accident here or what? Oh, this is not. Ooh. Hold on. Hold on. Slide that over. Okay. All right. Oh, there's going to be a problem here. Oh, no wasabi on the flanny. On the flan. On the flan. No wasabi. Oh. I think I. I think I did it barely. Right. Let me put these together. Very rich, made with many egg yolks, and we're not yolking around either. I'll be in ecstasy when I eat that flan. Okay, now, of course, I got caramel on one side of my sashimi plate. Right? That's not good. Ah, but I will carefully and slowly eat this. Okay. It's time for the ending of this week's lunch buffet, which is ice cream. Okay. I don't know what that is, but you know what? I always make jokes about it being radioactive, but I think I'm going to try it. It might be some kind of an egg-based ice cream. I'll, I'll try it. It's worth a try. What is that? Grape? That's probably sherbet or sorbet. Strawberry ice cream. Cookies and cream, which I don't like. You know, vanilla. The old standby vanilla. Okay, now. All right. All right. Give it a shot. I don't know what this is. Commodore Jeff Zambello and Exorcist Bishop Brian. I don't know what this is. But it's, ve it's very colorful. You know what? I better not take too much in case I don't like it. All right. I don't know what the heck this is. Oh, they still got flies? Whatever's left. Okay. All right, here you go. Ice cream? gonna go over here yeah. I don't know what this is I have no idea it's radioactive or it's made from eggs look at, look at the color on this it's radioactive I don't know what the hell it's definitely it's definitely worthy of a photograph I, I didn't take a lot because I really honestly don't know what it is but I'm adventurous. I'm willing to. Uh, I'm willing to give it a try. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. I will taste it right now because I have some on my spoon. You know what? This is. I think it's a form of exotic French vanilla because it tastes like vanilla. 
It is very rich and creamy. I actually like it quite a bit. It is a very rich, uh, maybe there's egg yolks in it, which will put us in ecstasy, combining egg yolks with um, vanilla, but it is a very rich vanilla, more rich than the standard vanilla. So I am pleased, I am pleased. Also, I would like to say that, to my surprise, this very rich French vanilla ice cream, very yellow indeed, also contains pistachios, to my surprise, pistachios. So it's the best of both worlds. French vanilla combined with pistachio ice cream. How about that? Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. This has been a Mega Life 21 production.